Welcome back. Let's understand how we can set up HTTP response over REST services in this video. As of now, we worked with input payload or attributes to the REST services. We are sending the input data either through headers or through the body or through both. In similar way, we also should set up the response in the headers also in the body to tell about the backend status to the front end user. So we will set the response in headers with the status codes and status reason. Here 200 is status code, OK is status reason. And also we set up some status responses in the body as well. Let's see that. If we look at listener connector, we have a section called responses under responses we see body and we see status code and a reason phrase right so in body if we wanted to say as success we can mention this as success and the status code as success so it is going to be 200 and reason phrase we can say as OK. Let's save it. Let the application get deployed. The application has deployed. Let's go ahead and make the request. Request came. And if I say next, the execution has finished and also the logger printed the incoming payload. And we look at the response, right? we can see as success which we had set up in the body and we see the headers as 200 ok whereas we set up the status reason as 200 and reason phrase as ok so this way we set up the responses by using http listener connector that's all about this session thank you happy learning